Yes, how are you? You look amazing. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Hello, Pumzi Pumzi. <laughs> Miss Squeeze is here. I'm good. <laughs> look at you. <laughs> good. My baby. Yes. Um, the first time I was introduced to you personally through Ozalo, yeah. the GC character. Mm -hmm. Right now, we know you across our television. You know, from Umundo Otseng Suga, Ksasa Nkebeli Paseng Suga, Em Tonongom, Ngeetegwe Ngeetegwe Otishin, Yee Nanga Mele Kotlos Komensa Ketsempi. Uguts Uban. I think it's a thing, 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 it's Uzo za wii otishinu, uza mugze nzu kaya, uza mugze nzu bonangu, uza mugze nzu somiz, ingo boga gaza asu ubani wena. So umufika ngo buwena, originality, leonto is simple, uzo ba rights. Kia bonga, who did this? Thank you so much, this was uh, Sikhe Masango, uh, yeah, local designer, but absolute beast. Kia bonga, thank you so much, kia bonga. You look so gorgeous. <laughs> okay, so just get on straight to it. This is an award, you know, and I want to just ask you one question. If you were to name this award, what would be the name be and why? Um, I would say resilience because I think it's, it's a resilience to be a filmmaker um, and it really takes a lot and I'm just proud that this was a collaboration so yeah I would call it resilience. <laughs> okay so are you from London? Or are you where no, are you based? So I am based in KZN. I've lived here for the last 14 years of my life. I love Durban. Um, this was a collaboration between a London um, director and myself and so we came together to make this film so yeah. Okay. So what would you say the, the, the international relations um, and the film what best collaboration they can put together and what could be the best possible results if those two departments were to come together and collaborate in really pro, um, exposing the work that KZN is doing? I think, you know, what's come out of this is being able to really get our crew from KZN to work on an international level, their work being exposed on an international level. Um, of course, with co-productions, the best thing is always about bringing two countries together and the resources and the finances, and that, that's really what we've done, yeah. So, yeah, that's what it is. Okay, so what was the biggest challenge with you being in KZN and the directors from London, what is, was the big challenge in terms of creativity between the two or production? I think, you know, the, I, I'd gone to London twice, but I think now with Zoom and after COVID, we've, I think the new normal is being able to just work like a nomad. So it doesn't really matter where you are, you find ways. There's digital technology that brings, that closes the gap. So I don't think it's such a big problem anymore. And so we didn't really have a, a lot of issues around that. Okay. Where to from here? Um, yeah, very exciting. Um, I have a feature documentary again in Durban. I love Durban. Um, I've pitched it at DFM, great results. Um, you know, I think the city has so much potential. It's, it's, a, it's a character on its own. And all my films I've made is in Durban. So I'm excited on this next journey. And yeah, I think we'll, we'll be putting Durban more and more on the map. Thank you so much. This was absolutely incredible. You look absolutely stunning. Congratulations. Go tonight. Scream. Finish a bottle. I love it.